what's up you guys so in today's video i'm doing a what's in my bag so i'm doing a what's in my bag in this bag right here so this bag is the coach town bucket bag so this is a bag from coach it's a bucket bag but this bag actually comes in two sizes so this one is the town bucket bag and then they have the coach small town bucket bag but i decided to get the town bucket bag or the bigger one because i wanted something that could hold a lot more stuff so without further ado let's get into this bag and then i'll show you like what the bag looks like and all of that um when i'm done emptying it out shall we so let's get started okay you guys so hopefully you can see this but this is like a overview of the bag so I'm gonna open it up someone had asked me in my haul video of me um, showing this bag if the snaps on here are strong and I think they're pretty strong now if you do overstuff the bag they will come undone but you can like it's like I don't know if you guys can tell, like it's not easy for me to unsnap it. Like I gotta use a little bit of fork, a little, a little bit of force, so yeah. So the snaps are pretty strong on this bag. So let's start with the outside of the bag. So outside of the bag, I just have my Coach um, Bear Charm right here. And then that's what he looks like. And then I have a Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer and a pocket back holder. So I, don't, I think that's what it's called. Forgive me if I'm wrong. So this is the pocket back holder. It has like a little flower right here. Hold on, they're getting entangled. So it has like a little flower right here. I think it's super cute. I like the matte um, finish of it. And it's like a woven material. And then if you open it, I just have this hand sanitizer in it, which is Christmas morning mimosa. Yeah, yeah I mean, if you can't tell, I'm ready for the holidays. Nah, I'm lying to y'all. I ain't even started doing my Christmas shopping yet, which I need to hurry up and start doing that. But yes, and then this is the front of the bag. And then this is the bag charm that's on the other side of the bag. Oh, and this is the back of the bag too. So this is what it looks like with everything that I have inside inside of it. Now, if you do overstuff the bag, it'll show like the bag will be kind of lumpy. So I wouldn't suggest putting things in here too high and packing it like outwards, if that makes sense. So let me show you guys the inside of the bag. So it comes with three compartments. So it has the front compartment right here, this middle compartment that zips up, and then it has this back compartment. So I'm gonna start with the front. So in the front of this bag, I just have my wallet. So this is my Coach Medium Zip um, wallet. Um, it has a like uh, maroon, I don't know what color this is. It's like a purplish brownish color interior. Um, it also has a coin pouch and yeah I really love this wallet it has a lot of storage in it and I like it is because it's pink too and girly so yeah that's my wallet from coach okay so next I have this lotion or hand cream I should say from Bath and Body Works it's in the shea butter scent Next, I just have my keys. So this is my Gucci key case and it just has all my keys and I like to keep my car keys on the outside because I'm always driving, so yes. Next, I just have my earbuds. These are from the brand, oh, not me missing one. Dang, I gotta find that. This is from the brand Tazo. Damn, where, where did I put that earbud? 
I had it this morning when I was on the phone. It should be in the living room. And then next I just have some Kleenex and that's it for this pocket. So this pocket is completely empty. So next we're gonna go into the middle pocket. And the interior of this bag is like a dark purple color as well. So in the middle pocket, I just keep my face mask. Then I have this dupe for the Louis Vuitton clay that I got off of Etsy. And inside here, I just keep like my charging cables. So I got like three of them, one. Two, three. And then I think the last thing I just keep in here is the tag for the bag. So yeah. So now let's move on to this last pocket. So in this last pocket, I just keep my vaccination um, card right here. And I got the holder from off of Amazon. I keep my inhaler because I do have asthma. Um, I have another lotion because you can never have too much lotion with everything that's going on. You got to frequently wash your hands. And if you don't, you're going to be ashy. I know from experience because I'm always ashy because I'm always washing my hands. And sometimes I forget my lotion. So yeah, you can never have too much lotion. And this is just the Jergens brand. And then right here, I just have like this little like bag charm that I actually got off of Poshmark. It's from Coach. It's like a turn lock bag charm. And inside of it, I just keep, oh, and it has like this little hook right here. Inside of it, I just keep some squinchers. Um, this is like the strawberry lemonade flavor. Some wipes that I got off of Amazon. Some gum. More squinchers because I really like these. A few um, sample size perfumes. So I have one, two, and three. So I have three of those in there. And yeah, that's it for what's in there. So next I have my um, Jennifer Lopez um, collaboration with Coach um, Wristlet. I love this thing, it's so cute and I especially love the chain on it. So inside of there, I just keep my eye drops because I do wear contacts. I keep a large hair tie. I keep a small hair tie. I keep a couple of um, roller balls. I think this one is Paco Rabanne Olympia. Yeah. Um, I have Prada Candy, um, Prada Candy Pop Sugar. I have Gingham. I don't know how to pronounce this, but this is from Bath and Body Works. I just purchased this, or my boyfriend just purchased it for me. I have a tie to go pin. Oh, and then it has two pockets in it. So in this pocket, I just keep two safety pins. Um, a black one and a white one and then I keep this um, nifty tool it's like a nail clipper a light um, I showed this in my last what's in my bag
Okay, so I have another pouch. So this one I got from off of Poshmark as well. And this is from Coach as well. And this is just a mini cosmetic case. I don't think they sell this on Coach anymore. But I, I am in love with this thing because it's so tiny and so compact. But it holds so much. So I'm going to open it up. I, have, I fill this thing up. So I just have this lip gloss from Victoria's Secret. I have a mascara. This is the Maybelline Falsies. That's an oldie buddy goodie. Of course, my MAC Lip Glass and Power Supply. Um, I have some tweezers in here. I have some um, oil blotting sheets from off of Amazon. I have two makeup remover wipes from Neutrogena, the small singlets. I have another lip gloss, because of course, same with the lotion, you can never have too many lip glosses. This is from NYX, and it's called Ice Princess. And then, and then last, I just have a pair of lashes that came with some hair that I ordered off of Amazon. I thought they were cute, so I might wear those one day. I don't know. And yeah, and then that's the end of that. That's all empty. Okay, and the last powder thing that I have on here is my Nolita 15. And if you guys see this burn mark, my bright self was over here curling my hair in the living room and I had it on my little plastic container and I forgot that it was sitting right there and so I burned myself with my curling wand. So yeah, yeah, how lovely. Now I got this ugly scar that I gotta figure out how to get rid of. But this is my Nolita 15 and inside of there I just keep this as like my, you know, um, bathroom bag, I guess, I don't know what to call it, but, or toiletry bag, something, but I just keep a pad in here, um, keep a tampon, some poopery, some more wipes, some Q-tips, a and aids a panty liner, two feminine wipes, so one, not one, but two. And yeah, it's pretty much empty now. And yeah, now this bag is pretty much empty. And that's it. So I'm going to put all this stuff back in here. Oh, well, let me show you guys the inside of the bag. But yes, so the inside of the bag, completely empty. This thing is not attached to the bottom, so it just flops. Um, that's the story patch right there, if you can see that. But I'm in love with this bag. This is like one of my favorite bags so far that I've purchased off of Coach. Let me clean this up real quick and then I'll continue to chat with you guys. Okay, so I wanted to chat with you guys real quick because it's like, I don't know if it's just me, but I've been loving these what's in my bag videos. And low key, before my birthday, which was July 11th of this year, I was one of those girls that only just carried their phone and their wallet around. Or I had like my keychain that just had like a puff ball, my keys, um, and a little um, card holder on it. And that's it. That's all I carried around because I didn't care about like purses and stuff like that. Because honestly, I used to, I used to hate holding purses like I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I did not like holding purses. I feel like it was a chore. Like, I love the look of purses, but holding them, like holding them like this in your arm, like, mm mm, that is not for me. But then I discovered like the shoulder bags, like this, and bucket bags, and stuff like that, and, cro that, and crossbodies. Because, mind you, I never was a fan of crossbody bags either because I'm very busty at the top. And then I would hate when I would wear the crossbody bags and then they would like, um, come in between the cracks of my bus and I hated that so much so it's just like dang 
what can a girl wear? Cause I like backpacks too, but I can't even wear those because I'm too lazy for backpacks to have to put them on and take them off. But I did just wear a backpack low key, but we ain't gonna talk about that. But now I'm loving this whole carrying a purse thing. Cause it just makes me feel so girly and whatnot. And then having it all nice and cute and organized and having all the girly accessories and cute accessories and stuff like that. So, now I'm always prepared, baby. Like I'm always prepared. So if I if I need to freshen up my scent, I can freshen up my scent. My lips a little crusty. I got several options for lip glosses. So I'm good. I'm Gucci. If I'm on the go, shoot, I'm on the go. Now I'm gonna these purses, buy purses and wear purses and having them nice and organized make me wanna go somewhere so I can use the stuff in them and you know just be bougie. And then another thing. But am I the only one that just love the sound of like having like a bunch of things and like hearing the sounds let's like, be like click 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 like let me show you like like this like I'm picking up the box bag and I can hear all the charms moving or like the sound of just opening the bag is just so satisfying and just open the zipper and rum it and opening the zipper and just rummaging through your bag is just you can just hear all the things just moving around like, and I don't know if that's considered like ASMR or nothing like that, but I love that. I hate the sound of people eating food. Hate that. But I just love the sound of this. Or like if you watch the makeup videos and they going through their makeup vanity and you hear them just click clacking away through all of their makeup and stuff like that. And I, comment down below if y'all like that. But anyways, I'm done chatting with y'all. So if you like this video, ooh, my ear itching. Hold on, y'all. If you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and comment some of the purses that y'all been buying lately. Now, for real, for real, for real, for real this time, I'm done buying stuff. For real, because I really need to get my shit together, because I'm playing at this point. But I would like to know what y'all are out here buying, so maybe in the future I might buy some more stuff, but I've been, look... Am I the only one that's like this that'll go months without spending no money? I be do it. I be on my shit saving so good. And then just out of nowhere, I get the itch to spend and it don't stop for like a couple of months. Am I the only one that's like that? Because right now I'm on the saving spree because I need to get it together because I'm playing myself. What, what DJ Khaled say? You're playing yourself and, and I'm playing myself. So, um, look, y'all gonna have to... I, I know y'all love these cold Charles, but I'm gonna have to chill on these cold Charles for a little minute. But I can't keep doing the what's in my bag since I have collected quite a few bags. I can keep doing that. But the hauls, girl, unless y'all subscribe, you know, help a girl get monetized, get some sponsors around these parts, you know. I'm just saying, then I can keep on spending money like I ain't got no damn sense. <laughs> But for real, with that being said, I'm out, y'all. I know y'all tired of me talking, and I'll see y'all in the next one. All right, bye.